Hey, what's up guys, this here, and welcome to episode 22 of our working career mode. And we're gonna start off the episode playing as Bradford City at home, we're currently in 4th place in the table um, we, in the start of the season. We have had hug, we have, we have had a good start, win, win, and a draw against Charlton Athletic. And, you know, most of those games was against the top end of the table, so hopefully we keep this run going. And, um, so hopefully we do well against Bradford. I've changed around the squad just a little tiny bit, but I'm so confident with the 4 one 2 one 2 second variation of the squad. And it's a very nice clear day, and hopefully we do well in this. Oh, come on, fat look. Come on, Shirley. Rip the ball in nicely. Kafo is there to put it underneath the goalkeeper and make it 1 0. 40 minutes into the game against Bradford City. Kafo is there to put it away and a very nice start to the game. Uh, now, I think I believe that's really the first chance of this game. First chance of this game there. Fowler uh, is turning out to be very good signing to me this season and Kafo and Fowler combined to the other there to have a good finish. We ball. Oh, yes. Surely now. Surely now. Fowler's away. Fellows away, I'm gonna go uh, near post finish. Hopefully, this goes in and it goes straight at goalkeeper. Very unlucky there. We've got a corner right now, I'm, I'm pretty sure of. Fellow that is definitely shining out to me this season. He gets the ball in. Azog is in the centre, but he has head on it. I thought he goes way too over the ball. And we're now, see it running down there. Cut back inside. Through ball, he's away. Nope, that's a bad touch though. Can he still? Yes. Oh, it's finesse this. Finesse shot. Beautiful. Kafar makes it 2 0. Uh, oh wow, that's beautiful. Good play. It was a bad touch to start. Tomorrow she gets away from the defenders and that's the shot into the back of the net. Very nicely done and wow. We're playing very good recently. Oh no, here he comes. Tackle. Oh, it's beautiful tackle, but it's open net. No. <laughs> oh my god, he missed that. Reed missed an open net. A good tackle. Uh, from Bad Molina, I believe, open it and he just couldn't get it wide. And it's just not the day for Bradford City. Oh, Karen Hall. Wait, whoa, oh my god. I thought I, complete, I thought I completely failed by panicking this person B too really. But it almost went, back, went into the back of the net anyway. But the whistle does go 2 0 to Wickham against Bradford City, which will most likely, I believe, be a you know very high promotion contenders. And beating them 2 0 home is definitely very nicely done. Two, a brace off Kafar. Very nicely done. Fowler's also shining in the game as well. He's got the man of the match, 8.9 rating. Uh, keep up this form, and we will definitely be doing well in League One this season. So now, for the next game being Tramier Rovers away. I'm going to look down by the right corner and look at the table, and look at us with third place. Very comfortable. Um, we've won three games and drawn one for the start of our season, which is very nice. And coming up to the end of the transfer market as well. And I feel comfortable with my side. As you can see there, I, I do like how this side plays. Fowler and Kafar has been outstanding for me this season so far. And um, I feel like I, I feel like we can do well with this squad. So I'm possibly not going to make any transfers. But, but we are inevitably, inevitably going to be playing against Tramier Rovers now. And uh, let's, let's play in that kit. I don't think I've played in that kit for quite a while. But... Let's do this, drum your rovers, and let's keep this form going, shall we? Oh my god. I almost pushed through the entire defence. Here comes Potter, though. Here comes Potter again. Wow, what a start of the game. Out, just bursting out there. Just pushing through like tanks. Here comes Fowler with the cross. Melini is there to get it. Wait, come on, come on. In 1 0, in the fifth minute, Potter there gets it in his own. I believe a second goal, third goal to see um, of like being Rick and Colors. And oh my god, well, the three places went without me pressing anything. I think that must be the EAA. It's about any online. I think I like how that is going. 1 0 up so, straight off the bat. And wow, what a start. Oh, come on now. Come on, make it 2 0. <laughs> he actually did it 2 0. I dog. Let's do some flips. I know he isn't as dry enough to do some flips. But 90th. Um, yeah, 90th minute, not 90th. 19th minute into the game, 2-0 no up, and we are, wow, I'm definitely not expecting this. I, I don't know what's happened, but our squad is just connecting together, the chemistry is going very well, and Jesus, wow, what a, what a start. Oh, free ball, come on, let's chip this, let's be cheeky, oh, I'll never be cheeky again, that was absolutely terrible. Oh, nice tackle there, the foul is now away, can he, wait. Oh, let's just do this and that. Finesse it. Oh my god, what a start to this second half. 3 0 up. Good for there, making some space. A good tackle through ball. Making some space for himself. And a finesse shot into the bottom corner of the net. Wow! 
Oh man, this is beautiful. Beautiful play by Wickham here. And 3 0 up against Tramir Rovers. And there we go, the full time whistle does blow 3 0 to Wickham against Tramir Rovers away. Potter, Azorg, and Kafar gets on the score sheet. And a very nice game for us. We've seen um, re recent games, we seem to, you know, get a very nice bond, chemistry together, very nice start in both halves, which definitely is still the deal. Transfer offer for Alex Penner, our goalkeeper. Okay, okay. Um, I feel how much I bought for him. It couldn't have been that much. Well, let's see how much they want him for. And he wants for 100, oh, 110,000. Hmm, and we can possibly sell them for 204,000 maximum. So I'm going to just, um, I'm going to steal that offer and see which goalkeepers are like, on, on, on the market. I don't know why I think that, but I'm going to be pushing to sell him anyway and selling Penner. Um, I don't know, I need to change rage budget, rage budget a bit, but I'm going to be selling Penner because he's a, he is a bit poor, but he can get the job done. But I think I've got to move on and get my third goalkeeper of the series again. Here we go now. So, here we go now, so 3,000, 4 gears, and I'm pretty much crucial because, you know, he's, he's just, he is going to be my only goalkeeper, which I'm going to use, so I'm just playing now for crucial because he's just going to get played every game anyway, but there we go. Okay, so we've got two emails in our mailbox, we've got, um, they, they decided to accept it and go for 180,000 for Alex Penner, so that's very good considering I have already bidded on uh, the other guy. That we just about to buy, and Joel Kafar and our team really wants him. They notice that he's been playing very good for me, and hopefully they do a better offer than what the previous guys did. And no, no, 60k, no, just no. And there we go, Patagonia accepted, and hopefully, hopefully that Penner does leave. So then, so then, you know. Everything is all good, and now, oh no, sorry, there we go, he has left 150,000, goes into my transfer budget, very nicely done. Oh, we got an email in, and this is going to be another offer for Kafar, let's see how much money, 70k, <sighs> no. So guys, we're going to be playing round 2 of the Capital One Cup against Blackpool at home, this is going to be a challenge for us, and they will most likely give us an idea about, you know, where we stand, and hopefully we have a, we keep our run going against Blackpool. Oh, come on, Kafar. Okay, over the net. 1 0. There goes Kafar in the 15th minute. And wow, what, what a start to the game against Blackpool. I don't know what's going on with me right now. I don't know if I just, you know, got better at FIFA all, all of a sudden. I mean, you know, I don't know what's happened. But the team is going very well. Oh, ooh, they've had a chance there. First chance of the game for Blackpool there. And my new standing stepping up. And you know, it was a pretty easy save, but thank god he didn't fa fail for us. And he can use the attack, it seems. Lewis, very slow pace, but it's a gap through the center. Free ball, free ball can Kafar keep up? Can he get it? Can he? He has. He gets a shot on his turn off. Oh my god. I so didn't expect him to get that. Wow, I did not expect him to get the ball there. I didn't expect him to keep up the ball, but he did manage to do that. I didn't. Wow. I did not expect that counter attack to happen. That's Pushed him off the ball and put it into the bottom right corner of the net. Oh wow! I did not expect. Wow! It was it was off, it was offside nonetheless, but that was a good effort, and that would have been a good goal if it wasn't offside and it, and it did go in. Bicycle kick, and nonetheless, it was actually a good save of the goalkeeper from that close up. Oh, here comes Kafar. Oh, surely. Oh, wow, he could have made it a hat trick. I believe that. I believe that would have been his hat trick. Good 
Oh, beautiful. Chip it. Oh, could have gone so well, but a Zug just couldn't get it on target. It would have been so beautiful. Um, brilliant through ball, brilliant touch, but the, the, the actual shell itself wasn't wasn't on target. But tune up against Blackpool, still being very comfortable. So I'm very happy with this game. Well, that looked promising, but he's been stopped. Well, he saw the guy could switch the play to and came up with the pass as well. Excellent. Oh, free ball to Fowler. Well, he make it 3 0. Surely he make it 3 0. I know the goalkeeper pulls up a brilliant save. He kicks it out, and Whistle does go. He won 2 0 against Blackpool in the Cup. No more penalties. Thank goodness. Hopefully, we get away from that now because every single Cup usually ends up in a penalty shootout. But anyway, top, speaking of that, this will be the end of the episode, and a very good way to end it off is by showing you the league table, which we are, in fact, in first place look at that we are drawing drawing on goal difference and i want to say thank you guys for watching for this amazing episode winning all games in fact uh, okay uh, please please guys give us a like my um, target is five likes for this episode hoping that you guys enjoyed this episode thank you guys for watching my name is Vincent. i'll see you next time